SOLIDWORKS uses one of three basic planes to define a drawing, front, top, and right. These planes correspond to the planes used to define orthographic views. The top plane will be used to demonstrate the first few tools. An outline of the top plane will appear using the trimetric, orientation, that is, a type of 3D orientation. Click the sketch tool. The top plane's orientation will change to a 2D view. The top plane appears as a rectangle because the view is taken at 90 degrees to the plane. This means that all 2D shapes drawn on the plane will appear as true shapes. Click the line tool. With the line tool activated, locate the cursor on the origin. The origin is indicated by the two red arrows spaced 90 degrees apart. Two icons will appear on the screen, the line tool icon indicating that the line tool is active, and the coincident relationship icon indicating that the origin and the starting point for the line are on the same point. Click and move the cursor away from the origin horizontally to the right. Click the mouse to define the endpoint of the line. Move the cursor vertically downwards. Do not click the mouse. A new line will be drawn using the endpoint of the horizontal line as the starting point for the vertical line. Distance and angle values will appear based on the new starting point, and the line and vertical relationship icons will appear. Press the escape key or right click the mouse and click the select option. Click the smart dimension tool, click the line, and move the cursor away from the line. A dimension will appear. Click the mouse to define the location of the dimension. The modified dialog box will appear. Enter a distance value for the line and click the green OK check mark. Click anywhere on the drawing screen to complete the line drawing. 